All right. So we have a trick equation here. So we uh, we need to show. So you need to find out that to make it become that one. Otherwise, it doesn't work. You have to show it, not the other way around. So we have 4 cos minus cos 2 theta plus 5 sine theta. I have a double angle formula here, but then this is the sine on the other side. So I will use the sine one. So 4 minus 1 minus 2 sine square theta plus 5 sine theta. So I rearrange that. 4 minus 1 plus 2 sine square theta plus 5 sine theta. Rearranging it, then I will have 2 sine square theta plus 5 sine theta. 4 minus 1 is 3, so it's plus 3. That was what we want, and it is done for part A. So part B, you need to solve this equals to 0. You use the original one, but I copy the question first. Minus cos 2 theta plus 5 sine theta equals to 0. We have done that at the top, so then we have 2 sine square theta plus 5 sine theta plus 3 equals to 0. This is a quadratic, but to let us feel better, I will have a equals to sine theta, and then we have 2a square plus 5a plus 3 equals to 0. Oh, that makes us so much better. Then we have a times a, 2a times a equals to 2a square, and 3 and 1. Cross multiply it, we got 3a plus 2a equals to 5a. Nice. So we have 2a plus 3 and a minus 1 equals to 0. Back to the sign, 2 sine theta plus 3 equals to 0 or sine theta equals to minus 1 equals to 0. Rearranging it, sine theta equals to negative 3 over 2. You need to reject that because this will not happening. And then we have sine theta equals to 1. So that uh, negative 1, this is, oh, sorry, this is plus 1 here. So this is negative 1. So theta will be equals to 3 pi over 2. And that is the answer.